it's it's quite uh, hectic for the the, uh, the two weeks I suppose leading up to it. It's really um, the merchandise side of things and making sure uh, we've got enough red shirts and the volunteer stuff has gone out. When you look at the beach from up above, it's, it's organised chaos. Uh, we know what's going on, but if, if you walked up and you looked at it and you went, you know, <laughs> how does this work? <laughs> So is this your first time participating in the Disabled Surfing Association? No, this is its 19th out of 20 times. It's missed once with with our two plastered legs, so pretty much got a perfect record. He loves surfing. volunteers get as much out of it as the participants do. A lot of our volunteers come from our, our community where we actually have a really, really good, strong community spirit in, in Ocean Road. Mm -hmm. And most of the people who uh, are in the uh, disability fields like you for how many volunteers? <laughs> they, they, they're really amazed. It's like that other, yeah. Um, and what's your favourite part about the um, day? Probably just playing in the water, <laughs> eating sausages, <laughs> eating lollies and carrots. <laughs> what about helping people catch waves? Love it. it is it is such a great feeling. I see the faces and I see the people that come out of the water and I absolutely adore that, that they're having such a great time. Actually. Yeah. I enjoyed it loads. And what's your favourite part about it? Well, I just like surf. Well, I just like the surfing. So it's like really good. Well, just being able to go into the surf is fantastic. It felt fresh. It felt really invigorating. Um, compared to the pool, it was just beautiful. First year she came down was a young lady, Celine, who was, who is, should I say, um, a ventilated quadriplegic. So basically from the neck down is no movement and can't breathe by herself. So to put her in the water is one of those cases where she's putting her life in your hands. 
She has a breathing apparatus to help her breathe, which will be tucked in under her arm there. Okay? You see that moving, whatever, just secure it. And even if you have to run with the board, but that is a vital piece of equipment. It won't be a long ride, but it'll be a safe ride. Okay? Let's get into it, guys. Thank you. Yeah. I didn't know anything about this event until last year, which was the first time I had participated. And because I loved it so much, well, I had to come again. And I'm so grateful for everyone who participates and actually makes this event possible because there are people with disabilities. It's such a pleasure to see everyone smiling whilst enjoying the beautiful waves behind us. And what does it feel like when you're riding a wave into shore? Freedom. It's beyond description. I just lose myself. It's good to know freedom was 